Our bodies have two main types of acetylcholine, nicotinic and muscarinic. One of my mentors, Dr. Isaac Crawford, taught me that only nicotinic acetylcholine receptors were in the brain. However, we now know that muscarinic acetylcholine is present in the brain and vital for creating new brain cells. Acetylcholine is crucial for memory. We're also trying to understand these processes for diseases like stroke, brain trauma, and Parkinson's. Acetylcholine also supports neuroplasticity, creating new brain cells and connections. It works with other neurotransmitters like gas GABA, glutamate, and neurosteroids to generate a protective and repairing orchestra. In recent discoveries, phosphatidyl inositol 3 kinase plays a role in turning immediate memory into long-term memory. This involves cholesterol. Acetylcholine drives these processes that depend on cholesterol, highlighting its importance in learning, memory, and brain growth from infancy to adulthood. This underscores, again, the importance of cholesterol for your brain.